Welcome back to First Take, presented by Chase Retail. USC football coach Steve Sarkeesian has apologized for his behavior Saturday night while giving a speech at the school's Salute to Troy event for alumni and donors. Sarkeesian appeared to be drunk in slurring his words. Get ready to f right on, baby. Let's go. Athletic director Pat Hayden had to intervene and was seen berating Sarkeesian backstage after he disparaged USC opponents and used inappropriate language while introducing his team to alumni and donors. S Stephen A., what should SC do? They should suspend him immediately. That's what they should do. Um, the punishment obviously is not satisfactory simply because there was no punishment at all. Um, what I would do is at this particular moment in time is defer everyone to a column written by an individual that I consider to be the voice of Los Angeles and that's a Mr. Bill Plasky, a uh, columnist extraordinaire for the Los Angeles Times. You're talking about this Salute to Troy event where you have parents, where you have alumni members in attendance, you have, this is an incredibly important event to USC. You know it ahead of time. You're Sarkeesian. You've been there before. You're fresh off a nine and four season. You succeeded Ed Orgeron, okay, who succeeded Lane Kiffin. And he went seven and two before he was the guy that Pat Hayden, the athletic director, elected to pass on in order to pursue you and bring you on board. And this is how you, pray, you repay him with this embarrassing display? There's no question that a punishment uh, obviously should be forthcoming here. Should he be fired? I would not go that far. I certainly wouldn't go that far. Um, now, I will admit to you, I don't consider myself biased. I don't know Sarkeesian at all. I interviewed him once when he was at ESPN headquarters uh, sometime uh, earlier in the month when all the conference coaches came through. Seems to be a very nice man or what have you. But in reading Bill Plasky's column in the LA Times today, they talked about how with this smoke there's probably fire. He alluded to that because apparently alcohol and Sarkeesian have been mentioned as a pair on several occasions. Apparently this is not the first time people have seen him a bit inebriated. When you take into account the fact that you're supposed to be a leader of men, when you also take into account USC's relatively recent history where guys like Reggie Bush can't even come on campus and they're not acknowledged because of what their parents did or you see other things that have taken place or Elaine Kiffin being unceremoniously dismissed from his job in the middle of the night, etc. Fresh off the plane, didn't even get off the runway before he lost his job. Clearly, Pat Hayden doesn't play games. Clearly, he wants to send a message. And when you look at it from that perspective, and you're supposed to be a leader of men, particularly in Southern California, at a program like USC, and you start down, you know, down talking, opposing programs, not to mention being a bit inebriated, which obviously speaks to a lack of discipline. How are you in any position to lead men? And that's just the way that I look at it, Skip Bayless. I think mm -hmm. that a suspension, anything less than a suspension, is nothing more. It, it's not even a slap on the wrist, if I, 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 in my opinion. And I also remember, and it's something else Bill Plasky pointed out into, in his column, years ago at Michigan, you had a coach in Gary Moeller, who was 44-13-3, and, and got himself in trouble in an alcohol-related incident in public. He was fired. Yep. Fired. And so when you look at the precedent that has been set when we're talking about college football, being a leader of men for college athletes, especially considering the troubles that college athletes find themselves in in this day and age, what position are you in to tell them anything if you conduct yourself this way in front of everyone to see, knowing that you had this event to attend, knowing you would be asked to speak and still showing up yep. in the manner that you did? It's incredibly irresponsible, and as far as I'm concerned, not a fireable. He yeah. should be fired, per se, but he should definitely be suspended. I'm with you on this one. No firing, definite suspension. Pat Hayden, tough spot right here, right now. I know Pat. I covered him when he played in the National Football League for the L.A. Rams. I respect the heck out of him, but he's got a big decision ahead of him here because... 
obviously it matters to those people who attended that mm -hmm. kickoff event, those major donors. This team really matters to them. This team this year just might be good enough to at least compete for the national championship, to be a playoff team. It's that loaded with a veteran quarterback and Cody Kessler back. I, I saw Sarkeesian when he was here at ESPN. We stopped and spoke in the hall for a few minutes. I, I've always loved his football mind. I do not love this behavior. Stephen A., you, you need to suspend. I, I guess, and this, this might be viewed as wrist slap suspension, you have a couple of opening games that aren't that tough with Arkansas State and Idaho. Could you suspend them for those games and still kind of keep your team unity intact going forward into the Pac-10 or Pac-12 schedule? Maybe. It, this is a rough call because you brought up the key issue here. Is Sark, as Pat Hayden calls him, starting to develop an issue handling his alcohol? Because I agree with you. This is a, a touchstone event that kicks off each year, again, for your major donors. And if you can't handle your alcohol before this one, man, can you handle your alcohol before anything that really matters, even a football game for that matter? I don't know. That, that's scary to me because by all accounts, and we've only seen a snippet, as we said, of the video, but, but he, was, he was just flat out inebriated. He was slurring words. He was hanging on the, the dais there, on the... You know, he, he's, he's cursing in public to major donors and longtime Trojan faithful. It's just the wrong place, wrong time. Again, I'm with you. It's, it's not quite fireable, but it's definitely suspendable, and it needs maybe to, to be looked into a little deeper here. Does he have some issues he needs to address? Well, Pat Hayden will, as much as he loves Sark and hired him and stood behind him, I think he's going to have to look a little deeper into this issue. Well, listen, I mean, fine him. I think he should be fined about $100,000. You know, make him go into AA, you know, at least a couple or two, a few sessions, and outside of that, suspend him for a couple of games. Yeah, that's I what I think should happen. A couple I think of sessions, but. But again, you should look well, into. Well, I, I'm just, I, I'm just saying, go to whatever yeah. amount of sessions you need. In mm -hmm. other words, we're making the assumption that you have an alcohol issue. If you can show up to an event that you know is that important to us in the in the in, in the state that you were in, yeah. we're going to assume the worst. So let's make sure we address it for the sake of our program. We're also going to find you, all right, and suspend you because we want to make. We want to make sure these kids know yeah. you can't even think about doing this yourself. I am very much with your big point about what message does this send to those kids? Not a good one. You can't lead them. Nope. What is, who are you? Think about it. If a kid came in there and was struggling with alcohol, yeah. if a kid got himself in trouble with the alcohol, what position are you in to say anything to that kid? Mm. Very, Simple question. Very good point, and that's the most important issue. And as you mentioned, they've got a pretty good squad this year, eighth oh. in the AP poll going yeah. into the season, so hopefully they can get that all straightened out. Moving on, we focus on the pro game again, though. Randy Moss said he still has an itch to play, but what does he have left in the tank, and is there 